कांखंतंतर्मनांसिद्धिंजदंतायुधेवता चित्रं ही मानसी लोटे सिद्धि भवति कर्मजा People they are naturally following leadership, but they do not want to follow the leadership of Sri Krishna because they want immediate relief from the. Uh, misery of this world. They do not want a permanent solution of all misery. Uh, Krishna, if we accept the leadership of Krishna, then in this very life we can make a solution of all the miseries of material existence. But instead of following the leadership of Krishna, we accept leadership which is also indirectly the leadership of Krishna, but it is misrepresented because on account of contamination of this material nature. Material nature is inferior or lower nature. <coughs> Constitutionally, we are following the leadership, but uh, we want immediate temporary relief for our misery. We do not want permanent solution of all misery. That is the defect of our life. But here is a chance. If we follow the leadership of Krishna, then we make a solution of the whole misery. Tankanta, Tankanta, Sadharmanan, Siddhi, Jadanta, Yadivata, Sipram, He, Manasi, Loki, Siddhi, Bhavati, Karmaja. Ah, Karmaja means those who are acting here on the line of creative activity. Uh, suppose and we have experienced that there are so many political leaders, they follow some particular leader and they capture the governmental machinery. But after some time they are taken away from the scene. Just like in our country, recently, within one year, Pandit Jalal Nehru, he is also shifted away. Uh, Shastri is also shifted away. In your country, the President Kennedy is also shifted away. We do not take into account that after shifting this position, again we are going to enter into the miserable life of material existence. If we do not make a solution in present life, then we are again going to enter. Suppose in this life I am elected to be the president of this great state, United States of America, and if my next life I become an ordinary citizen or even an animal, there is no guarantee what I shall become in my next life. That depends on my work because the whole body is given by the material nature. It is not made according to my order supply. Ah. Prakite Kriyamanani Gunai Karmani Sarvasa. You are given a chance to act here. But according to your act, it will be judged what you are going to have in your next life. 
That is your problem. No, don't make this life of fifty years, sixty years, or seventy years, or hundred years as all in all. You have got a continuous life of transmigration from one body to another. It is going on. We must know that. And here is a chance to stop this nonsense of transmigrating from one body to another and suffer the material misery. Here is a chance. And how that chance you are going to utilize, that we have already discussed. Tattadeham punajjanma naiti maneti kauntya. If somebody simply study critically the transcendental nature of Krishna, the transcendental nature of his activities, simply by knowing this, the benefit will be that tattadeham, after treating this body, you are not again going to have such a material body, but tattadeham punarjan. Punarjanana, you are not going to take your birth again in the womb of a mother of this material nature. So, just believe it. It is standard. It is accepted by all the great stalwarts, scholars, and acharyas of repute. Just like Sankara Acharya, Ramana Acharya, Madhya Acharya, great scholars and acharyas. They have accepted it. Mahajana Dena Tatastapantha. We have to follow the footprint of great saints and sages, those who have achieved success by this indication of Bhagavad Gita. Don't follow your wings. Take this standard advice. Just try to become Krishna conscious. Just try to understand Krishna. What is Krishna? And the result is that after leaving this body, you are no more going to accept any material body, but you enter into the spiritual kingdom and you have your spiritual body which is eternal, full of knowledge and this This is the chance. Krishna says, although the chance is there to keep out of foolishness, exactly this very word has been used in the seventh chapter. Namam Dushkitana Muha Pradante Naradhama Mayana Aparita Jana Asuri Bhavama Sita. He has used very strong words. The person who are miscreants ah, do not care for vice or virtue, never mind. They don't, they don't care which is vice and which is virtue. Such persons, ah, duskritila, those who are always engaged in deepest work, and those who are foolish, namang duskritana murha, prapadante naradhama, naradhama means lowest of the mankind, and maya apuhita jnana, and one whose knowledge is deluded by the external energy. Ah, these people, they do not take the shelter of Krishna. They do not like, although the opportunity is open for everyone. But we may not be like the miscreants, foolish, and waste of the mankind. Let us become intelligent. Krishna consciousness is not very difficult job. 
It is the easiest and the highest, topmost uh, type of yoga system. Uh, it is and twelve chapter you will find it explicitly stated that one who always in devotional service of Krishna, uh, he is the first class yogi. One who is always constantly in Krishna consciousness, he is the first class yogi. And that is also stated in the last verse of the sixth chapter also. And it is accepted by great scholars and hatharjas. So, here is an opportunity. It is very simple. Very simple. Simply thinking of Krishna. Tatatang Chintayat Vishnu Matkabdang Satato Vishnu Vishmatkabdang Najatasi All a simply if you think that Hare Krishna, if you think simply Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Uh, that is sufficient. Even if you do not go into the Bhagavad Gita, if you do not go into the Sunat Bhagavatam, simply as you are chanting, Krishna has given us the ear and Krishna has given us the term. No expense. No difficulty. We haven't got to go to college and take degree to become Krishna conscious. Ah. It is easy for the rich, for the poor, for the learned, for the fool, ah, for the black, for the white, for the rich, for the poor, everyone. Ah. There is no distinction. Because Krishna is for everyone. Mani part of the path is to the Tishu Papajana. In the lower nature, everyone thinks, oh, I am better than you. Ah, the Hindu think, ah, we are better than Muslim. The Muslim thinks we are better than ah, the uh, Hindus. The Christian thinks you are better than the Jews. The Jews think you are better than This is material uh, conception. But for Krishna, there is no lower or higher. Every living being is part and parcel. He comes here to claim everyone. Come on. Come on, my dear son. Why you are suffering this? Ah. It is not for you. Take this down. Jada jada hi dharmastra prani bhavati bharata. So, Krishna consciousness is so nice. But one who does not care for it, they are uh, satisfied for her by some temporary leave and they take to other courses, they do not take the leadership of Krishna. Tankantam Karanam Siddhim Yajanta Yadevata. Yadevata means his material gods. Material gods means their existence is so long this material world. That's why here we have got the president, the governor and so many big big officers. But suppose somehow or other the whole planet or the whole thing is gone, destroyed. Because we can expect destruction every moment. Bhutta bhutta praliyate. The whole thing, I mean to say, the president and the governor and everything is gone. So, iha devata. So, we are taking center of this material world, something big, that that will not exist. With the annihilation, with the dissolution of this material world, everything will be dissolved. Everything will be dissolved. So, we have to take the leadership of the Supreme. Then, uh, it will be the largest perfection, the greatest perfection of life. 
Now, Lord Krishna says, Karmana, Karmana and Siddhi, how they, in the material world, people are working, he is analyzing the process of different occupation. What is that? Chakut Bandang Maya system, Gunatanma Vibhavasan, Tasa Kattaramapi, Mana Vidhi, Apattab, Mana Vidhi, Apattaram Abhayam. The Lord says that uh, Chakut Bandang, four castes or four divisions of human society. You have heard that there is caste system in India. There is caste system in India. There is caste system in India. Sometimes Indians are criticized by the outsider that they have caste system. But here the Lord says, the Chatubhannam Maya system, Gunatanma Vibhagata. This caste system is created by me. This caste system is created by me. How? Gunakarma vibhagasa, according to quality and according to work. That division in the human society, according to quality and according to work, is there in everywhere, everywhere in the world, not only everywhere in the world, but everywhere in the universe. God's creation cannot be stopped. God's creation cannot be stopped. Just like in God's creation there is sun, there is moon, there is seasonal changes. Nobody can uh, stop this. Similarly, the Chatubhannam and according to quality and karma, that division prevails all over the universe, not only in India, but also in your country also. In your country. And what are the divisions? Now, what are the goon and karma? The goon, the quality, there are three qualities in the material world, there are three qualities. The quality of goodness, the quality of passion, and the quality of ignorance. And either human being or animal or demigod or American or Indian, everywhere these qualities are working. But some of them are in the modes or quality of goodness. And some of them are in the quality of passion. And some of them are in the quality of ignorance. Those who are in the quality of goodness, they are called Brahmins or the intelligent class of men. In Sanskrit language, because intelligence Intelligence does not mean to know, to have some knowledge of the material things. Intelligence means to know about the spiritual world also. That is intelligence. Ah, because as you know that I am combination of matter and spirit. I am spirit and I am now entangled in this material body. I am spirit consciousness. I, as soon as I am out of this body, I can distinguish. Uh, or I, can, I cannot distinguish. So I go away. You can distinguish that now this real Sanity spirit is gone. The Sanity material body is here. That's it. So it is very plain thing. So therefore, we should not only have perfect knowledge of this matter, 
but we should have perfect knowledge of the spirit also. If you are actually intelligent. Therefore, the Brahmins, why they are called Brahmins? Brahma Janati iti Brahman. Brahmins is the English uh, and Sanskrit shirt. But real word is Brahman. Brahman. And where comes this Brahman word comes? Brahma Janati iti Brahman. Uh, that means one who knows the spirit, the spiritual, one who, has, one who has got complete knowledge of the spiritual world, he is called Brahma. Who, how one becomes Brahmana? Uh, how uh, now, here you will find distinctly the Chaturbhannam Maya system Gunakarma Vibhagasa. The four divisions of qualitative division is uh, set by me according to quality and karma. Never said the according to birth is part. According to birth it is not said here. Although in India it is now misrepresented that a Brahmin son is trying to uh, designate himself as Brahma. But according to Bhagavad Gita, that is not sanctioned. Bhagavad Gita says according to quality. Uh, now just like here is uh, a, a qualified lawyer, Mr. Goldsmith, he is lawyer. Now, because he is lawyer, his son cannot claim that because my father is lawyer, that I am also lawyer. But how it can be done? The son also must be qualified lawyer. He must pass a bachelor of law degree examination. Then he can be done. Similarly, the, here Krishna says, don't misunderstand the Indian caste system as hereditary. No. It is according to David literature. It is according to the quality. And what is that quality? Janmana Jayate Sudra. Janmana Jayate Sudra. Anyone who takes his birth, by his birth he is a Sudra. Sudra means the lowest, in the lowest order, everyone, even if he is born in the family of a Brahmin, he is to be considered as a Sudra, Janmana, by birth. And perhaps some of you know that the Brahmins, the Kshatriyas and the Vaishyas, they are called Bija. B means twice and Ja means birth. Twice born. Twice born. The bird is also called twice born. Why? The bird, birth is first of all in the egg. So the egg is fermented, then the real bird comes out. Therefore, bird is called in Sanskrit language also Dija, twice born. Similarly, a man, unless he is twice born, he is a sudra. Twice born. How is that twice born? Because uh, by birth, anyone, everyone has got some father and mother. Because without father and mother, there is no question of that. So the beast has also got father and mother, and the bird has also father and mother. Similarly, a human being has also got father and mother. So this birth by father and mother is not sufficient for becoming a bija. He has to take his birth again. So Janmana Jayate Sudra Sanskara Bhavit Bija. But birth is not 
all, everything. Oh. The culture, sanskar, sanskar means culture. One has to take his birth, rebirth, by culture, oh. by education, by knowledge. Ah. That is called cultural birth. So unless one is in the cultural birth, he is to be considered the lower gate person or the sudra. Oh. So therefore, the system is according to Varnasam Dharma that not only by birth, before birth, when the father and mother is going to be combined to beget a child, ah, there, there are cultural samaskar or reformatory measures. Ah, how much carefully these things that they, they wanted first class son, not sons like cats and dogs, first class son. So there is some samaskar, there is some purificatory measure which is called Garvadhan Sansta. Garvadhan means pregnancy. The cultural uh, ceremony before making the mother pregnant. And it is enjoined, you will find in the Bhagavad, that any family, the Brahmins, the Satriyans, and Vaisar, if they give up, this Brahmadan Sanskar and the birth giving ceremony, then that family turns immediately to the classification of the Sudra. So, nowadays, at the present moment, this cultural program, I am speaking of India and everywhere, there is no such cultural program. That cultural program, that program to beget nine children, uh, the whole program is, we must know, the whole baby system is to give the human life the greatest chance of self-realization and get free from this material misery. That is the whole program. It is not, the baby culture does not mean that we shall be like cats and dogs simply eating, sleeping, smitting and defending. No. The human society is a systematic program to give everyone the chance of getting free from this material misery. Just like every state is supposed to be welfare state, every citizen of that state, state should be happy, should be prosperous, there should be no anxiety. I do not know if every state is taking care of the citizens in that way. People are always full of anxiety, they are creating situation. That everyone is full of anxiety. This material world is made so that it is full of anxiety. Uh, whoever is in the material world, and even the bird, you will see, when it is taking some grain, he is also full of anxiety. He is looking like this and that. Oh, somebody is coming or killing me. So, this is the nature. The human society. Human society is so arranged that the people, the members of the human society should be free from all anxiety. Therefore we require good citizens, good father and mother, good system of government, and pious, virtuous, ah, cooperation between God and nature, Everything will be helpful for my spiritual realization, for my self-realization. If I am full of anxiety, how can I make progress in future 
realization. It is not possible. Therefore, it is the duty of the state, duty of the father, duty of the teacher, duty of the spiritual master to give chance to the small children to develop in a such a way that he becomes fully realized the spiritual soul at the end. And so that his miserable life in the material existence is over. That is the responsibility. In Bhagavati we say that Vishabde said that one should not become the spiritual master. One should not become the uh, father. One should not become the mother. One should not become the husband who cannot give relief from these miseries of material existence. It is the husband's duty also because the wife is under the protection of the husband. He has got so much responsibility. Ah, woman class and children class, they are taken in the same category. They require protection. They require protection. That is the ah, manusangita. Nasyang satantra hati. Women should be under the protection. They should be given all protection. So, the system of uh, taking, that's just like the Hindu system is, that's a, that's a word. Uh, before attain, attaining the age of puberty, he is handed over to a suitable boss to take charge. Before he gets his full energy. Uh, so this is the system of Varna Samtha. Oh. This is the system. The whole idea is that everyone should be given the chance of being liberated in this very life. Oh. No more waiting for, again, uh, for father, another life. Who knows that I, I am going to be human being again? It may be, by freaks of nature, I become a cat, a dog, a cow, an animal. Now we are uh, very much enthusiastic to become good national. Suppose I am American, a very good national. Now, after that, suppose as I become a cow, then, even I am national of this country, oh, I am destined to be sent to the slaughterhouse. So we should not take the risk of next birth in this life. In this birth, we should make a permanent solution of all religion. That is Krishna's concept. Let us become Krishna conscious in this very life and make a solution. Now this Chatudvarnam, this plan of Chatudvarnam, Lord says, you, you, you should always remember that this material creation, whole material creation, there are unlimited number of universes and I mean to say, planets in each universe. In the Brahma Sanghita it is stated, Yasa Prabha Prabhavato Jagadanda Kochi. Jagadanda Kochi. Jagadanda means this universe. And Kochi means uh, uh, hundred million. Hundred million. Not exactly one hundred million. But numberless. The Saprabha Prabhavato Jagadanda Koti Koti Suasesu Vasudhadi Vihuti Hindam Tad Brahmanishkanam Anantama Sesu Bhutam Govindamadi Purusam Tamaham Hajame. So this material world is created 
it is created for temporary existence. Mutta Mutta Pradiyate is fine in the Bhagavad Gita. This material manifestation is temporary, maybe for millions of years, but it is temporary. And why this temporary material world is created? Just to give the rebels, I am to say, living entities who are averse to God consciousness, Krishna consciousness, to give another chance for development. For development. So if you miss this chance, uh, then again when this material world will be dissolved, oh, do not know how many millions of years you have to become uh, unconscious. It shall remain in the unconscious sleeping state. Then again there will be creation. Then again our body will be created. Uh, so these are very subtle laws. Uh, we should not mean, we should be very uh, much uh, serious about this law. So the whole program is made. Chātut Bhandang Maya system. So by birth one is supposed to be the low birth. Janmana uh, Jayati Sudra. Sudra means uh, without any culture. The man who has no cultural life, he is called a Sudra. And those who have culture, they are called Vija. Vija means twice birth. So one has to take his birth twice. He should not be satisfied simply by taking birth by the father and mother. Uh, one should be anxious to take his twice born, to be, become twice born, Brahmi. But that chance is, don't think that uh, uh, you cannot become a Brahmi. You can be, become a qualified Brahmi, provided you uh, abide by the qualification of a qualified Brahmi. Just like to become a lawyer, it is not, uh, uh, I mean, it is limited to a certain section of a certain person, anyone who takes the qualification of a lawyer, he becomes a lawyer. Similarly, here Lord says, chātut bannam maya sushyam gunatarna dhuvāra. According to quality and karma, these chātut bannam four classes, or four tasks, or four classes of division of the human society is created by me. Ah. So, brahma jānāt is the brāhmaṇa. If you want to know Brahma, because that is a prerogative of your life, human life, Vedanta Sutra says, Athāta Brahma Jivyāsā, Athāta Brahma Jivyāsā, oh, here is the chance for inquiring about Brahma. Athāta Brahma Jivyāsā. Now, now we should take this chance to become a brāne as soon as we begin to Inquire about Brahma or the Supreme Brahma, Krishna, then my process of becoming the Brahmin begins. Ah, you know that uh, the Brahmins, the Kshatriyas and uh, the Vaishyas, they are called the sacred threads. You have seen, I have got the sacred threads. Eh? This is, of course, not very valuable, it is, <laughs> it is made of uh, cotton. But this is a batch. This batch is given to a person who is twice born. Who is twice born. So anyone can become twice born. There is no uh, hindrance. In fact, in the Bhagavad Gita, Mahanghi Pāsantapāsvitya jepi su pāpajuna ियांतिपरांगतेन्दुनाभ्राह्मणापन्यालाजस्वत्ताराजस्वयस्वथा I am born of a great nation, that's all right. You are born of a great nation, that's all right. But uh, next cultural birth to become a bija, 
Christ was. He's the awaiting. Uh, the Lord Krishna says, yes, I give chance to any, everyone to become bigger. Man, he passed the past, he said, it is his Papa Jonas. Never mind. Wherever he is born. Now the human society, everyone thinks that he is low and big. Or everyone thinks. In, the, in his own consideration, he thinks, I am the biggest, I am the big, and he is lower. That is everyone. But uh, <coughs> Lord Krishna is not considering who is bigger. So he says, even though he is considering that I am low born. Uh, because if everyone says that I am low born, it is a propaganda that you are low born, you are low born. So I think, yes, I am low born. Uh, Dasatakri Bhagavan Bhut. Uh, this time there was a clique, and uh, there was a Brahmin. Uh, was, his name was Bhagavan. So he has some enemy. So mm. the enemies, uh, they ten enemies, they sat down in ten places. And wherever you are passing, oh, you have become ghost, you have become ghost. Uh, oh, how I am because I am living. I am living. Okay, next, uh, next post he goes, oh, he also says, oh, you have become ghost, you have become ghost. If this man he passes ten posts, he thinks, oh, I might be, I have become ghost. Otherwise, everyone says, I have become ghost. So, Dasu Chakra Bhagavan says. So, uh, if everybody says, I am low one, I am low one, so I also think I am low one. But I am not low one. I am Brahmasmi. Ah. I am Brahmasmi. I am finished soul. I am born of Krishna. Krishna is my father. Think like that. Think like that. Ah. That is twice born. That is right. The Krishna says, Man he part of the past system. Anyone who takes center of me, never mind what he is. Oh. Never mind. He may be low word, he may be a sudra, he may be a woman, he may be oh. whatever he may be. He is anti parangati. He can also go to my kingdom. Oh. Our duty is to become Christ born just by culture, by Krishna consciousness, let us take another birth. Let us take another birth. Then you will be recognized, Brahma, Brahma Janati. As soon as you know Krishna, you are Brahman. Never mind whether you are born in America, Jekoslaviti or any other place. It doesn't matter. So try to become a Brahmin. Here is a chance. But how to become a Brahmin? Simply by purchasing two cent towards this track and getting on the body? No. Ah. There are qualities. Karma. You have to act like a Brahmin. And you have to acquire the qualification of a Brahmin. Then you can become a Brahmin. There is no impediment. Never mind wherever you are born, that doesn't matter. So here is Bhagavad Gita is giving a chance to everyone to become Brahmin or the qualified person who knows Brahma and who is preparing himself for the next birth in the spiritual kingdom. He is called Brahmin. Chakupanamaya system. Now, Lord says, Tattva Pattaram api maan vidhi apattaram abhyam. Although I have created this system, still uh, I am not there. I am not there. Why? Because Krishna is neither Brahmin, nor Sutra, nor Chatri, or anything, anything from the material world. He is transcendental. Uh, when we go to Krishna, a spiritual body, we also become like Krishna. In transcendental body. That chance is given here. Uh, so just, it is our duty. 
एवरी वन लॉर्ड चैतन्य श्री कृष्णा हिंसा एज ए डिमोटी ऑफ कृष्णा बट ही नेवर से दैट आई एम कृष्णा बट फ्रॉम बेसिक रेफरेंस एज टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट इज कृष्णा बट द सेम मिशन द कृष्णा मिशन एंड लॉर्ड चैतन्य मिशन इज इज देर हाउ इज इज सेम Krishna, as the supreme personality of Godhead, he says that you surrender unto me, and Lord Caitanya says you surrender unto Krishna. The same thing. Uh, Lord Caitanya says, "Ah, uh, what is the philosophy of Lord Caitanya?" Lord Caitanya says, "Arad Bhagavan unse jese yata naya tad jamam brindamanam." रम्मा काशी उपासना गजबधू वर्ग भी जातिता जगद भागवत ममलम पुराणम प्रेमा कुमार्थ महान श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभो मतमिद तत्रादान पर लाल चैतन्य इज दैट द कृष्ण इज दी ओनली ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ वर्ष And as Krishna is object of worship, similarly he is blessed, uh, Brindavan, Brindavan Dham. Those that visited Brind- uh, India, uh, Brindavan Dham, is still. If you go to Brindavan, uh, without knowing about Krishna, you will at once see Krishna consciousness. You will set in that place. Uh, so that Brindavan Dham is also worshipable. And. ब्रह्मा का अधिक उपासना ब्रजम धूप और गभी कया कल पिता नौ कृष्णा वॉज वर्षित बाई दी डैम सेल शॉप ब्रजधाम लॉर्ड चैतन्य रेकमेंड दट इज दी हाई टॉप मोस्ट ग्रेड ऑफ वर्षित बिकॉज दैट वॉज प्योर लव डैम सेल शॉप ब्रज लव कृष्णा सो मच विद आउट एनी विचार लेट इज सम लाइन सो ही रिकमेंड दैट इज द हाइस्ट फॉर्म ऑफ वर्ष ब्रह्मा का उपासना ब्रजबुधि जाकुल पिता श्रीमद भागवतम ममलम पुराणम एंड श्रीमद भागवत इज इज स्पॉटलेस बेबी क्लीटर बिकॉज श्रीमद भागवतम इज फुल ऑफ कृष्ण कॉन्सियसनेस ऑन जस्ट लाइक दिस भगवद गीता इज फुल ऑफ कृष्ण कॉन्सियसनेस इट इज दी प्रिलिमिनरी स्टैडी ऑफ श्रीमद भागवत The last word of the Shrimad Bhagavad Gita is the Sarva Dhanman Parikta Jamaane Kang Saranam Vajya. You give up everything. You just surrender unto me. Krishna says, "One who accepts this philosophy, that I accept Krishna as a Basu Deva Sarva Me Tisa Mahatma Sudhirava, then for him, Shrimad Bhagavatam is the most valuable study. And Shrimad Bhagavatam Mangalam Puranam." Prema Kumar Kumha. Now we are searching. We are searching our self-interest. Everyone is busy of his own interest, but they do not know what is real interest. They do not know what is real interest. The real interest is to invoke the dormant love of Krishna. That is my real interest. That dormant love for Krishna is there in every one of you. Don't think that because I am born in India, therefore I have got love of Krishna within my heart, dormant or manifested. No, that dormant love of Krishna is within you also. Ah, Krishna is neither foreign to you or foreign to me. He is for everyone. Therefore, love of Krishna. Is there permanently, but it is covered. Simply, it has to be invoked. And what is this process of invoking? This is the process. Just as like you are discussing, you are chanting, and you are reading Bhagavad Gita, you are reading Madhav Bhagavatam. This association will help us. This association will help us to invoke that dormant Krishna consciousness. 
So, if we are told uh, one, it will be uh, um, interested in hearing a story. Not story, it is actual fact. One of my god brother is no longer in this world. His name was uh, <coughs> Bhakti Sarana Goswami. Uh, he went to London. The start of your New York. He went to London and he formed a society also there in which uh, Lord uh, Ronaldson, the Marquis of Jetland, he was formerly governor of Bengal during this period. And uh, in our childhood, when we were college students in boyhood, uh, I saw him. Uh, he is uh, very interested in Indian philosophy. He is a smart man, but uh, very interested, Lord Ronaldse. So that Lord Ronaldse, uh, he was very kind enough to become the president of the society, my god brother organized in London. So Lord Ronaldse, and that my god brother is talking, so Lord Ronaldse asked him, Well, Samiji, can you make me a brahmin? Yes. Why not? Uh, yes, why not? You can become a Brahmin. Uh, so what are the conditions? Oh, and why God Brother said, say preliminary four conditions. What are these conditions? The Triyasana Panadvita Jatrapa Satudvila. You cannot have any illicit connection with Oma. You cannot have any intoxication habits. You cannot indulge in gambling or unnecessary sporting. And you cannot live on animal food. Lord Donald's reply is impossible. Huh? It is impossible. <laughs> so, uh, these things, these four principles, Preliminary, if we actually want to be a Brahmin, then we have to take care of the four principles of love, just to become a Brahmin. Yes. Then everyone can become a Brahmin. There is no bar. And whoever becomes a Brahmin, he, he knows what is Brahma. And Krishna is for a Brahma. Ah, for a Brahma. We will find it a tenth chapter is addressed by Arjun. Para Brahma, para Madhama, Pavitam, Paramam Bhava. Oh, I, by studying Bhagavad Gita, I now understand that Krishna, you are para Brahma. Paramdhama, you are the center of everyone. So, he is para Brahma. So, Anyone who becomes a Brahmin, he first of all knows what is Brahma, Brahma Jigyas, the Supreme, the Absolute Truth. And the Absolute, when one who knows Absolute Truth and enters into further post study, he understands Krishna. And as soon as he understands Krishna, then his next life in the spiritual world is guaranteed. So this is the process of Krishna consciousness. This is the simple process introduced by Lord Krishna, uh, Lord Chaitanya. Lord Chaitanya also supported this uh, philosophy of Krishna that anyone is eligible for going back to the kingdom of Krishna. Oh. The simple process that is also stated in Bhagavad Gita, we have discussed that simply by knowing the transcendental nature of Krishna, we become eligible for entering into this thing. Simply by knowing. That's to try to know, try to study what is Krishna. Huh. And do you know what is the recommendation of uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he said that Shiva Sudra, Shiva Vipra, Nasikane, Noy, Jai Krishna, Tattva, Sai Guru. 
That means uh, it doesn't matter whether he is a householder or a sami, renounced order, or a brahmin, or a sudra, or a low one, whatever he is, that doesn't matter. If he knows the science of Krishna, he is a bona fide spiritual man. If he simply knows the science of Krishna, this is Chatubhanda Maya Krishna Gunata. It is the quality. That's why uh, if I go to a medical man uh, or a, uh, mm-hmm. a lawyer, we go there for his qualification. We don't ask him, well, sir, are you Christian, are you Jew, are you Indian, or American, or Brahmin? No. We are concerned with the qualification. It doesn't matter what he is. He may be an American, he may be an Indian, he may be a Christian, he may be Jew, he may be Hindu or Muslim, it doesn't matter. He is a practice, medical practitioner, so he is a qualified man, I have gone there for my treatment. Similarly, uh, Lord Chaitanya also says the same thing, and Krishna also says the same thing. Never it is a, he is chasing on birth. Uh, birth is no consolation. Nobody is responsible for his birth. He may be low birth, but what is that? Uh, and he may be high birth. Uh, that doesn't matter. But when he comes out from the womb of the mother, he has got his own responsibility. Uh, he has to advance his cultural life in Krishna consciousness. That is his response. That is his response. Of course, father, mother, state, teacher, friend, they can help us. But ultimately, the responsibility lies with me. If I want to enter into the kingdom of God, or Krishna, if we want to be Krishna consciousness, there is no impediment. There is no impediment. Ahitaki ya pratihata. And the Bhagavad says that if you want to cultivate, the Krishna consciousness, it is without any cause and without any impediment. Because it is transcendental subject matter, it does not depend on any material condition. On any material condition. There is no consideration of material impediment. So it is open for everyone, Chatupanna Maya system. That is a chance given that you can become a Brahmin, you can become a great devotee of Lord Krishna, and you can become the spiritual master of the world. That is the... And I think, if you take seriously, uh, I am old man, uh, if you, some of you, at least, uh, understand the science and take up the science, and uh, you become a uh, future hope of the this country or the world. Uh, that is my request to you, that you should take this chance and become a spiritual master for all the people. Thank you very much.